What's up, ladies and gentlemen? How y'all doing on this uh, fine August Thursday afternoon? I'm just sitting out here, enjoying the weather. It's beautiful. Listening to Country ni- uh, Mix 96, uh, Mexico, of course. And as always, I got my fresh brew tea. So, um, thought I'd come on here today and share a short story with you. Uh, I think it's kind of funny. <laughs> so, but I, I've not always been a, what you'd say, a good person when it comes to uh, women you know womanizer all that good stuff kind of ornery Uh, so I was messing around with this old girl uh, Dana was her name and she had this uh, I, I forgot what, it's been a while a long time since I've told the story because you know like I was saying in other past videos if you don't tell stories you tend to forget details about them as you grow older that's with me anyways so I can't remember exactly what kind of car she had I know it was green and it was like a an old Pontiac or or something like that. It was a big car. Big ugly thing. That four door. It had a big block in it so it was long winded. I mean you get out there on a big highway and she'd roll on. So uh but anyways we was hanging out one night and I was gonna drive go somewhere and have some alone time. So I was just driving down the highway, and I was driving, and I have, I did have a lead foot, lots of speeding tickets, <laughs> lots of speeding tickets, so, but anyways, I was driving, and we was, I was cooking along pretty good, and, uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> got pulled over, I can't remember if it was like a highway patrolman or a I think it was a highway patrolman. <laughs> Got pulled over. So before uh, before I pulled over, you know, for the guy to come over and talk to me, I talked. I told her I was like, "Here, trade me places." And uh, I said they won't give you a ticket. I was like, "They give me one because I've had a lot of tickets." So they're gonna. He's gonna give me one. It's going to be high at all. I said, but they'll let you go. And I said, if he gives you a ticket, I'll pay for it. <laughs> so, yeah, all this was, I guess he was running plates and whatnot. So, uh, I got her to, I talked her into swapping seats with me. And, uh, <laughs> so, she got a ticket. And it was a lot of money. It was over a hundred dollars, cause I, I was I was moving on, and uh, I forget exactly how much it was. I know it was over a hundred dollars, and uh, so like I said, I told her that I'd pay for that ticket. <laughs> but when the ticket came to her, I didn't pay for it. I feel bad about it now. It's still funny, but. Uh, I should have back then. Uh, if if I was the person I was, I am today. Yesteryear, I, I I'd pay for that ticket. <laughs> so good. It wasn't really right, but uh, it's still funny though. <laughs> it's still funny because I told her I was like, he won't give you a ticket. I just know he will not give you a ticket. <laughs> Wrong. She got a ticket, so. But anyways, that's the little story I wanted to tell, make a note of it, 
as always, and say, God bless you. God bless President Trump. And God bless the United States of America. You folks take care.